Hello everyone. I'm coming on with an incoming swap and this was the sweet treat swap hosted by um, Mika and Rocky and it was uh, well of course it was a sweet sweet treat themed and the requirements were 10 Christmas themed die cuts, two Christmas treat shakers, one recipe card, Christmas recipe card embellished, an edible treat, a $5 gift, and everything packaged really cute. So let's get into it. I'm not going to show the address, but this is the box. So I am just going to... <gasps> Oh, look at this. Okay, so this doesn't have their information, but I will link their information down below so you can find them. Isn't that cute? That's cute. That is really cute. Okay, so it looks like this is just a simple package swap, so I'll take it out and remove the box. That's a nice box just in a swap, and isn't that cute? Oh my goodness. Okay. I'm going to remove this. Whoops. Whoops, whoops, whoops. I found this. I don't know where it's from, but I'm going to guess it's from somewhere. All right. I was thinking maybe I'd be able to. Ooh, my favorite. I'm thinking I might be able to find out who it was real quick, but nope. So I have this really pretty soft ribbon here. And look at this. This is really pretty too. This brown ribbon here. Ooh. Isn't that pretty? I like it. Okay. We'll dig into it. Oopsie. Maybe that's not it too. Okay, so we're just going to slide this off. I don't want you to see me on the struggle bus trying to knot it. So, all right. Isn't that cute? Cute, cute, cute. Let's see how it opens. Okay, so it opens this way. And I did not order Hannah's little jelly purse from KS Craft. I saw Nicole's uh, video when she made it, and I just thought it was so sweet, but I had ordered already some from Scrap Diva, so I figured I didn't need another one at the moment. So here we have two pairs of socks, or a pair of socks. Oh, look at that. Nice and warm. Isn't that pretty with the kitty? Oh, I smell something really, I think it's this one. I like the bag. Oh, yeah, it smells like candy cane. Well, look at that. Who doesn't need this in the winter? I definitely do. One pair of socks. Oh, nice. <gasps> this will be really nice. I am going to save this and put this in my room. Yeah, I like these. Cute. I used to have a calico kitty, a rescue kitty. She's passed away. She lived for 19 years, but this kind of reminds me of her. All right, let's see. So I think we have this upside down. So we'll just pull it out of here. And we'll save that. Look at this bag. Isn't that cute? Oh, matchy, matchy. I'm going to pull everything out. Whoops. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Oh, isn't that cute? Seeing it in person, I might have to get it after all. That is just really darling. I like how she did the brown and the pink. I just, those colors to me just go so well. And it's pretty sturdy, too. I'm trying to see if she double-layered it or... Yeah, I think she did. I think she double-layered it. 
I do that to just make it stronger. Okay, I'm going to set that right here. And first we have a milk chocolate hot chocolate spoon, which I do have some hot. Oh, here. She sent some hot chocolate too. I love peppermint, so this is just perfect because I really do like peppermint during the holidays. We get... Um, we get a little thing called Carolina at a store name, Aldi, no, no, I think we do get it at Walmart. We have an Aldi's in the next county over, but that I like, and I like the peppermint in my coffee. So I do put this in coffee just to give it like a creamer flavor. It's so cool. I like it. I know some people don't, but I mean, here's the candy. I definitely like this. So this will be a nice sweet treat to eat, definitely. All right, and then here's our, oh, the recipe. Oh, here's the recipe. Semi-homemade best cookie ever ingredients. Oatmeal chocolate chip cookie mix, egg, butter, ooh. Well, it looks pretty cool. Oh, this is from Cruz. I call her the Dangle Queen. Oh, no Dangle? Oh, I'm disappointed. <laughs> I'm really disappointed. She is known for her, 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 uh, her dangles are so cool. Okay. But this looks really good. I'm trying to see, and it doesn't look like it has added sugar, so. Oh, I won't do the coconut. I don't like coconut, but, or the raisins. But I don't think that would matter anyways. Mm, that looks really good. This is really cute. This is really cute. What a great idea. Okay. And then this would be, oh, her die cuts. What a cute idea. <laughs> oh. All right, let's see. Let's see if I can take it off without hurting it. Oof. Oh, I can. Oh, that's cute. I don't know whose dye this is. I'm, I'm going to guess it's a KF's craft dye, but I'm not a hundred percent sure. So, let's see how we open this. Oh, here's some fun, 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 fun die cut. Oh, oh, so that little one did come out of it. Here's the, let's scoot this over. So here's the gingerbread girls and some houses. Well, these almost look like cookies, don't they? These do, these look like cookies. I love those. Peppermint hearts. I see a theme with the peppermint. <laughs> oh. Look. That is so cute. She's just got these little peppermint buttons. She's really cute. I like those. Well, this one I could probably use for Valentine's. Let's see. And it's really nice because I do not have any of these dies. So this is really terrific. Not cute. So these all look like cookies. Then we have marshmallows. Let's see. They're on foam. So they're on that nice sturdy foam. I get foam like this from Hobby Lobby. Not cute. Then you can decorate them any way you want, right? I have um let's see, did she did I see something? 
Well, I have a shaker cup that I got from KS Craft, and I bet these would just look really cute in there. Like a little hot chocolate cup. We don't have any marshmallow dyes. Well, no, I take that back. I have a Jada Blossom s'more dye set, but I don't know that they have marshmallows. They probably do. These are really cute, though. I like those. All right. And, oh, see, here's a cookie tray. Wouldn't that, isn't that cute? Oh, I can't wait to play. I'll have to make something. I'll have to make something with that. I have a little tiny cookie tray, but I don't have a cookie tray that is this big. So this is really cool. I really like it. <laughs> I I remember seeing this when Shamika put this on now. I, I don't remember the whole swap, but I do remember this. I thought this was such a sweet idea with the gingerbread in bed on a cookie sheet. <laughs> And the cookie sheet that I have isn't even this big. It's it's pretty small, but that is too cute. <laughs> okay, and let's see. I think this is a bag topper. So it looks like I can make it the way I want or put it together, which is really cool. Look at this little guy. He is darling. Yeah. The reason why I knew this was a bag topper is because I just got some from Letta. And I thought they were embellishments, but they weren't. They were bag toppers. Isn't that cute? That'd be so cute. Oh, I love it. Love it, love it, love it. All right. So here's my, oh, I don't have this one either. I keep thinking I want to get it. But now that everything is almost over with and I'm kind of done, I never did get it. I'm going to peel these off. Otherwise, they'll stick to things I don't want them to stick to. all right isn't that cute i just love this little swirly thing i have been making gingerbread um, faces but i don't think to do this little swirly on the top that is just so cute that is really cute i like the sequin mix too and she's got the little buttons as peppermints also this looks like peppermint paper i don't even know what collection it is and then here's her little dress <laughs> oh that's so cute so cute so okay here we go with the next one and this is the last shaker oh yeah that cute she did a um a hawaii swap theme and that's kind of what this reminds me of this pine cone it's just pretty paper huh nice and festive all right all right oops i got my hair on it Is really cute. I have a gingerbread. She has a snowman. I have a gingerbread one like this. Isn't this cute? I don't have this dot either. And see, she's got a little marshmallow in there. She's got two of them in there. Isn't that cute? That's just as cute as can be. Oh, she's got some little balls in there. This must be a, a mix. 
Oh, I like it. Oh, I like the little mush marshmallows in there too. That is so cute. Look at the colors. I just like the colors she used too. Okay, let me see if I can find something with her socials on it. Um, if not, I'll just uh, link it below. Um, I don't think so. So I'll just, I, I know, I know how to, she's on both Instagram and, uh, sorry, I'm just knocking everything all over looking. She's on Instagram and YouTube, so I will definitely link her below so you can find her. She is, she is such an excellent, you, you just can't believe some of the things that she, she makes. It's just so inspiring, very inspiring. So you need to go and check her out. Her dangles are just gorgeous, just gorgeous. So anyways, I will close this up for now. And thank you so much for coming to see what I got. And remember, Jesus is the reason for this season. And I know this will be posted after Christmas, but I do hope that your holidays were very pleasant and that you were able to hug and kiss a loved one. Thank you. Bye.